The Reese Raw 500 Servo. This thing's got 450 ounces of power at 6 volts, 500 at 7.4 volts, 565 at 8.4 volts, with a top speed at 8.4 of 0.08 seconds. How fast is that? It's also brushless, 6 point waterproof, and has steel gears. We're going to put this in the Capra. Take a look. It gets its name from the raw finish, and the 500 comes from 500 ounces at 7.4 volts. Looks nice, feels solid. The fit and finish is on point. Really, really nice. Now it comes with plastic servo horns. Although they are a beefy servo horn, you know, they are plastic and I probably won't be running those. It also has the little cushions and the little um, spacer things right there with some bolts. I won't be using those either. Now, the little spacer things over here, they can provide a little bit of cushion if you're really, you know, if you're really pushing it and hitting rocks and stuff, you know, yeah, they may actually help save something, but I won't be using them. Now, my capper has had the Reese servos in it from day one. This is the triple four or 444. This thing has taken a beating with no failures. However, let's see what that raw 500's got. This is at 8 volts. <laughs> wow. That's awesome. <laughs> the Raw 500 up front with a triple 5 in the back. <laughs> Insane speed for a crawler servo. Holy cow, it's like fast enough to race with. That's nice. Now that we're outside. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Let's go ahead and put some weight on this. <laughs> Not a problem. Try to stress this thing out a little bit. I don't think I'm going to be able to get this thing wedged. I'd like to show you guys the raw power of this thing because it is quick and insanely strong. Kind of hard for me to show you sometimes because good old one-handed driving again. It's about normal. Yeah, I like this servo. Responsive, precise. Wow, this thing is impressive. Now let's see if I can... While I'm here, there we go. <laughs> Little bounce. Oof. All right, I guess I'm coming back this way. Oh, this server is awesome. I'm not just saying that because, you know, it's a Reese, but this thing is just flat out awesome. <laughs> I never even knew I needed a fast servo when it comes to crawling, but, you know, I think so. Now, this giant pile of dirt was dropped off about three days ago. Look at all the pine straw. So I got to do some work on that. But in the meantime, 
we can play on it. All right, see if we can come on over through here. Dirt is still really soft because, you know, it hasn't quite been packed down yet. <laughs> See, now this is where you need a second gear or a lot of wheel speed. Let me do this right here. Thought I was going to go into four wheel steer, but got the wrong program on. Almost. I know I can get this. It's just a matter of getting just the right bounce. That wasn't it. the big rock down all right all right good job making the hill a little softer and there we go Ugh. all right let's go over here to the sand Yeah, I would need a whole lot more motor to really make this worthwhile to bash around. Got an Axe 2300 KV in it right now with an 11 tooth pinion gear. So, a little slow. So, guys, what do you think? This Raw 500 is awesome. I mean, it's got so much speed 0.08 at like 8.4 volts. I was only running it at eight, so it's faster than what you just saw. It's stronger than what you just saw, and it had no problems in the Capra. This thing is very raceable. So I think I might put it in the Techno CR410. If you're unfamiliar with this truck, it's a truck I put together using a Techno SCT. Right now it's got the Vitavon beadlot wheels for the UDR, UDR sand tires and all that. That thing's fun, but this servo right here can go into anything you've got. Flat out. Strong, fast. Uh, the uh, specs say no BEC required, but they are recommending it. So I was running it on a BEC, a separate Castle 10 amp BEC. No issues. No issues at all. So I'm definitely going to get this into some race vehicles. I have some other technos as, as far as that goes. The ultimate home from this is probably going to be my Grimlock 3 truck. Yeah. Yeah. This thing is nice. Make sure you take a look at that description. There are links to get this servo. Order them directly from Reefs or any Reefs distributor or any uh, authorized retailer of Reefs products. Maybe they'll have these in by the time you see this, as of the recording anyway. So guys, um, yeah, this is one awesome servo. Guys, thank you all for watching.